I am James Valpiani. I go by Fangs. I am a colonel in the United States Air Force and a program manager here at DARPA. My role here is leading a portfolio of combat autonomy focused programs. I'm also dual hatted as the chief of combat autonomy for the Air Force Test Center. CypherForge stands for Cyber Physical Systems Executing in Real Time. Our objective is to accelerate the pace at which we test complex combat systems by an order of magnitude through two key innovations. The first is physics-informed digital twins that are executing faster than real time, capturing the best of our physics and the empirical data from our systems under test. And the second innovation is artificial intelligence test agents, which reason over our digital twin, as well as the environmental constraints to identify the most efficient and safest way to make the digital twin match the real world. There are really six core technologies that underlie these two areas. In the digital twin space, there's physics-informed surrogate modeling, there's uncertainty quantification, and there's data assimilation. And then in the AI test agent, there's three other technologies that we're interested in. One being knowledge maximization, the second being safety assurances that are statistically guaranteed, and the third being agentic artificial intelligence that allows us to essentially do end-to-end -end planning and execution of tests. Now the digital twin and the AI test agent, along with the system under test, constitute what we're calling a cipher. The digital twin generates high fidelity, physics-informed predictions of real-world engineering quantities of interest with quantified uncertainty. Then, the test agent reasons over these predictions to adaptively identify maneuvers that are knowledge-maximizing, statistically safe, and consistent with user-defined constraints. Then, the agent directs the system under test to execute those maneuvers with machine precision. Finally, the system under test generates large quantities of high fidelity sensor data, which the digital twin assimilates. All of this happens continuously and in real time, leveraging the explosion in cheap, high performance compute, machine learning algorithms, and ubiquitous data to make the digital twin a truth source that merges the best of our physics modeling and empirical test data in a statistically optimal way. If successful, employment of a cipher will allow test professionals to significantly accelerate the fielding of capabilities to the warfighter and with greater safety margins than today. So my previous role as a flight tester and as the commandant of the test pilot school has really played a large role in the development of this program. This experience of having this incredibly privileged opportunity to advance capabilities for future warfighters is matched by this frustration that the tools we have don't allow us to do the job at the speed and the rigor and the safety that we would like. Of course, the test profession, the flight test profession in particular, historically has been extraordinarily dangerous. And so this emergent set of tools, both in the digital twin space and the AI agentic space, represents an opportunity to address many of the problems plaguing tests at the same time. To go faster, to be more efficient, and also to be safer as we field cutting edge combat capabilities for the warfighter.